there, everybody. I am Craig. Welcome to Air Pop Control. Today we've got uh, a couple boxes to open up. We actually have a Chrono Toys box. Uh, there's four individual boxes in that. Um, we'll get to that one in a little bit. And I've got another box here from a company that we'll uh, go to first. We won't do any of that until right after this. All right, I am back. Before we get started on any of the other stuff, as always, I have to say hi to my grandkids. Hi to the post office folks. Uh, if you would, please hit that subscribe button down below. Down below, I would appreciate it. Give this uh, video a thumbs up if you like it. And hit that bell notification if you want to be notified of any other videos coming out in the future. All righty. I got all the important stuff out of the way. Now the real important stuff. Okay, I've got, uh, we'll get to the Chrono Toys one last, but we'll do this first one. This is from a company called Pop Hard Case, uh, Pop Hard Case uh, Company, and what happened is about uh, December 9th, I went back and looked, I did a video, if I can, I don't know how to do it yet, I'll try to put a link up, I think it'll be in this corner, or it might be in that corner, I don't know, I haven't done that before, but if I don't get it up there, it'll be, I'll put the link down in the description down below, but anyway, I ordered 20 hard stack protectors, they had some kind of deal, 60 bucks, you got 20 hard stacks, and then you got a couple free pops. I really didn't really believe it'd be any good. So I went ahead and ordered it just to see, you know, what it was like. Well, I was sitting here doing video one day and they showed up. The delivery showed up while I was just finishing up the video. So I brought the box in and made another video. And that's when you'll see with that whatever link I put up. Um, well, at about a few weeks later, I got a, a text message, I assume, from the president of the company or somebody at the company. And said, hey, thank you very much for the video, uh, and uh, we're sending you an extra bo another box. And I, I never even replied to him. So first off, I want to say I'm not affiliated with this company whatsoever. This is kind of unusual for me because I don't normally get these things from these type of companies. But uh, this is it. It's a, a box. I'll put their information down below. Uh, I did the, the thing they showed me when they shipped, it says there's two pops in it, mystery pops. I have no clue what's in it. You guys are going to see it with me the first time. But I don't know. But um, if you do look at that review I did, it did end up being a very good review. It was, I was very impressed. I uh, really suggest you go look at it. You, we all need hard stacks for some of our pops, whether you're shipping them or just keeping them for yourself. And this is a cheap alternative if you don't want to go with the uh, armor stuff from 7 bucks of pop. Okay. All right. So I'm going to do this mystery style. There's supposed to be two pops in here. That's big. That's a big box for two pops. Is that, a, is that a pop? It doesn't seem awful big for a pop. Okay. The first one is in a... Oh, shoot. Box there. Okay, the first one is in a hard stack. I assume it's their hard cases. Okay, you ready? One, two, three. Holy smokes, that's a Stranger Things Comic Con. Susie, I've never seen Stranger Things, but I hear everybody likes it and they watch it. That's a Comic Con sticker. Wow. That's a 2019. Huh. Wow, that's pretty cool. I think that's San Diego Comic Con. I can't read it, but I'm pretty sure it is. There's the back. Uh, if it's anything like the other pops that they sent me, this will be a mint box. It looks mint. I'm not going to take it out right now through here. But uh, yeah, they, these stacks are really nice. They just come off on one end. They seem to be really good. Okay. That was weird. I don't know. Huh, that's pretty neat, though. Okay, the second one in here. Let's see if there's a note or anything. No note, no anything. This isn't a pop. I don't know what this is. It's too big to be a pop. And it's in plastic. One, two, three. Oh, look at that. Mandalorian. It's a t-shirt. Does it have a pop in or two? No, I don't know. Wow, that's pretty cool. I don't know. Uh, it's a Star Wars Mandalorian. It does come with it. Yeah, I think it comes with a pop too. Yep, bobblehead pop it says. I was looking at the back here, and it does say down there what it comes with up there. That's pretty cool. 
Wow. We got Stranger Things, which is a great show, I understand. Mandalorian, I watch this all the time. Uh, does it say what size it is? I know they didn't give me the right size, probably, but because nobody harassed me. Uh, I don't see. I'm sure it'll tell me somewhere, but I don't see it right now. It's pretty cool, though. Wow, that company did a pretty good job, man. I'm going to have to thank them very much. That was pretty good. So, guys, Pop Parquet's company. I, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. I'm, I'm going to. I might look up the prices of these later, even though it's not it doesn't really matter, but that's pretty cool. All right, let's get to what we came here for today, which is a Chrono Toys box. Now this is, before I do this, let me read. As always, I have my handy dandy piece of paper here. I have to print stuff out now. Okay, this is a limited time event, Chrono Toys Damage Box Clearance Mystery Box, the New Year's Eve edition. I believe I ordered this on the 3rd of January. Um, we just got here today. Then today is the uh, 14th. So uh, let me see. This is a $15, $15 a box. I ordered four of them, so there's four of them in here. Um, you will get, uh, let me see, New Year's Eve. $15 includes free shipping, one exclusive pop with good return value. That's all it says. Uh, limit four per person. There are no commons. Exclusive chase and vaulted only, it says. Only exclusive, exclusive chases and vaulted only. You can only buy four of them. You're, uh, there's, they show four of them that you're, you have a chance of winning. Now, for $15, it doesn't say how many boxes were in this run. I assume there's probably a thousand or something. But here's four of the top hits. The Marvel Compound Hulk SDCC Metallic, condition 7.5 to 10. Uh, this next one's an ad icon, uh, Tony the Tiger Flocked, 7.5 to 10 box condition. MHA Masked Achako, 8 to 10 box condition. And the DC Blue Chrome Batman Toy Tokyo, 9 to 10 box condition. Um, so that's what's possible in here. For 15 bucks, it's not a bad deal. You can only order four of them, though. So I got four in here. Let's open her up, see what we got. Hopefully, we got something good. Something good. Okay, as, all, as before, oh, this is a little different. Uh, you know, it's a good thing, because you know, I've meant to show this to you guys. Uh, where is it? This box was pretty much crushed in on this side. You can see it. It's pretty much bad damage there. But they always ship uh, in pop protectors, or they did the last bunch anyway I got. And so I wasn't overly concerned about it, except they only put it in wrapped in paper. But this time... They did sewer boxes, so now I'm very happy. I don't think that damage is going to be any problem at all. This is the corner with the damage. Oh, look at that! Yeah, so it did get some. It got to that one too. Wow! I don't know what's going to be inside this box. I'm going to take these out. We'll do that one first. See what it's, what it is. Okay, this is a, we're going to do this one first. That doesn't look good, does it? I've had my fair share of damaged boxes lately. I don't need any more. If you watch my uh, last couple videos, I had a couple of boxes that were damaged pretty bad. But it was well taken care of. Okay, so I'm going to do it Mr. Style, even though I'm curious to see. Okay, so this is the end with the damage. Uh, yeah, right here. So the one... It's going to be facing up, I guess. This is the damage one. Okay, ready? One, two. Oops, I didn't take the plastic off. Did you have plastic off? There is no protector on this, though. I'm surprised. I thought they did put them in protectors. I'm feeling the box. It doesn't feel like there's damage on it. It does feel like there's a sticker. It's a round sticker. It could be a chase. One, two, three. Nope. Nope, it's a uh, overseas special edition. Movies. Dr. Ian Malcolm. I do have this one. Matter of fact, it's sitting right there. And this is the one that I believe there's a misspelling on the, the two Dr. Ian Malcolm ones. Uh, there's one of them spelled different than the other. I don't know if that's an intentional mistake or not. But, uh, yeah, I don't collect these. So this will be going on my 
for sale list, which you can find down below. I'll talk about that when I do prices here. And we'll do those prices here in a little bit. Okay, second box. Well, that box was not damaged at all, by the way. I didn't say that. There's a, not even a, oh yeah, there is. There's a little, little small dent here. Let me set this down. So I'll show you guys. Let me look. This corner right here is where the damage is. And it's not bad, but it is enough to, I mean, take the, I could probably fix most of it. It's not ripped or anything. It's just bent a little. Maybe iron it out. Okay, let's get back to this one. This box, the rest of them shouldn't have any damage. One, two, three. Venom Marvel overseas sticker. I, don't, I got a bunch of the overseas stickers on the last one too. This one <laughs> looks like he's trying to get an escape. Look at these. He's half out of the box. <laughs> he's not in his spot. He's trying to kick in the window, it looks like. Yeah, it's pretty cool. <laughs> trying to kick in the window. I do not have Venom from Marvel. I've got a bunch of Venomized Pops, but not Venom. That's pretty neat. He's got a spider on his uh, shirt there. I have no idea when this came out. That's a 2020 pop. All right, next one. Let's see what this one. I don't think those are anything special on those. Those com are not necessarily commons. They're overseas stickers, but I don't know what they're. Uh, if they're from Toy or GameStop or whatever, I have no clue. Okay, next one. Get ready. One, two, three. We've got How I Met Your Mother, Robin Sparkles. It's a uh, 2020 Fall Convention Limited Edition. I do not, I have seen How I Met Your Mother. See, this is a damaged box here. See that? The bottom there? That's all crushed in. That's uh, from that same damage, probably. Yep. And this side here is crushed in there. So, not good. There is a uh, fall convention sticker on it. Well, we'll see what happens there. I've had my fair share of damaged boxes lately. I think it's somebody else's turn to get some. Yeah. Alright, last one here before we do prices. See the color on it, which you know what that means. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Another overseas special edition. My Hair Academia. Hit, oh, I'm gonna butcher this one. Hitoshi Shinso. Shinso. Hitoshi Shinso. Okay, this box. No damage on that one. So this is the only box that's got a teeny little. Let me just admire a minor little thing right there. No, that looks pretty good. I'll give that an eight or eight and a half or so on there. But I do have uh, two boxes that are damaged. Actually, three that have some damage. No, wait a minute. Two. Just two. All right, let me do some uh, checking on prices. I'll be right back to you, folks. I'm back with some prices. Uh, kind of surprised about some of the stuff here. So we'll go over this. I'm going to go ahead and show you the prices of the uh, Pop Hard case stuff that I got just because I think it's kind of unusual that I got these things. I know uh, Stranger Things is really popular right now. Everybody's talking about it. I have not seen it, but I uh, suppose everybody's talking about it. Of course, The Mandalorian, I watch, and that's everybody's talking about that too. So i got two great things here. Um, let's go ahead with Susie first. This is actually the NYCC 2019. I said that in San Diego earlier. It's a New York City Comic Con. Uh, this is Susie, and uh, Susie's going for $30. $30. It's free. And it came with a hard stack, you know, so that's a hard case. That's even a couple more bucks. All right, so that was pretty good. And then there's this thing. Now, this is kind of interesting. This is the Mandalorian. It's a T-shirt bundle. It has the pop in it, and it has the T-shirt. Size large, by the way. I looked at it. I found there's oh no, a little sticker down there in the bottom that said L. Uh, I'm a XL to 2XL, so I, it is not going to fit me. 
So keep that in mind if anybody's interested in this. However, let me explain something that's kind of unusual. This bobblehead, or this is a pop in here is a bobblehead. This pop, well, okay, this bundle here is going for, what I write down is uh, $37 for the t-shirt and the, the pop. $37, not too bad. Now, if you were to just buy the pop by itself, which is in here, you know, I can take it out, it's gonna be like any other regular pop, right? The pop itself is going for 44. <laughs> so you're getting a pop and a t-shirt for less than you would just get the pop for. I, I don't get that one, but that's what's, it's on pop price guys. And I don't know if that's correct or not, but that's what they say. But if anyone wants a t-shirt, let me know. I make, or I may sell them separate, t-shirt and a pop. Okay, let's go over these uh, Corona Toys ones real quick. All right, first off, uh, we have got the Marvel Venom. Venom. It does have a little cut up here in the corner. You can see it there. Um, doesn't appear to have anything else other than he's out of his place that I can fix that. I just haven't done that yet. Uh, the box, other than that, it doesn't look like it was damaged from the... Uh, but it does because it looks a little smushed in here. So this is probably from the packing also. That's too bad, man. And, I, and nothing Chrono Toys would do about it. It's the shipping. Okay, next we're going to go with Dr. Ian Malcolm. Um, let me see the way this other one was spelt. I meant to look that up. Hold on just a second. Okay, this is Dr. Ian Malcolm. It's an overseas special edition. This is one with damage on it. This one was damaged pretty good. Over here in this corner right down, down here. You can see that's all bent up and damaged there. But it got hit pretty good there. Um, the rest of the box seems okay. This is a 2019 pop. Anyway, what I wanted to show you on this was, look at the spelling on this, Dr. Ian Malcolm, M-A-L-C-O-L-M. -L -L okay. Same, that's Jurassic Park movie. Um, and this is another one I have. This is Dr. Ian Malcolm. But look at the spelling on this one. It's M-A-L-C-O-M. And there's no L in it before the M in this one. They're the same person. I don't know if the misspelling is intentionally or if not, but they're from the same line, and they are spelled differently. Unless there's a kid, it was Dr. Malcolm, that I don't remember. If you know, put something down below in the comments. Let me know. Okay, so we got that one. Put this one back up there. Alright, so Dr. Ian Malcolm was running uh, $23. $23, and that's a Target exclusive. If I didn't tell you before, the uh, Marvel Venom overseas was a uh, Hot Topic exclusive. Alright, so let's go with uh, the next one. We'll do uh, oh, my, uh, my Hero Academ Academia. Academia. I can never say that right. I always say Academia. Academia. This is uh, Hitoshi Shinso. Tosi I don't know. This one's uh, exclusive to GameStop. This is the overseas sticker. This one, uh, the damage on this one was, I uh, don't think this one had any damage. No, nothing, nothing to speak of anyway. No, it looks pretty good. Um, anyway, this uh, My Hero Academia is going for $35. And last but not least, we have Robin Sparkles. Now, Robin did get a little damage, pretty bad, actually, in the back here. As you can see, it's got crushed in at the bottom. And that corner over there is damaged. So, not this one's not really great. Unfortunately, it was a big hit of the box. <laughs> this uh, Robin Sparkles is going for $36. And this is a uh, Fall Convention, uh, Convention Limited Edition sticker on it. So uh, anyway, those are the four pops I got from Chrono. I paid $15 a box. I got four of them, so my total was $60. There was no shipping fee involved in this. Uh, my total I got out of it was $112. I almost doubled my money on that one. Even though damage, and I can probably go put a claim in with the post office, but I don't know, you know, it's always a hassle. Anyway, so Chrono Toys did very good. Both boxes. The one I got last time, the High Roller, which I think I made more money, or about the same on this one as I did on the other one. So I'm not sure. Um, anyway, uh, thank you for coming out and watching. I appreciate it. More damage. I'm, I'm getting damaged boxes for some reason. Again, thank you very much to the uh, Pop Hard Case Company, and I will put their information down below. 
Chrono Toys information will be down below. You see anything in this video that you want? I've put, uh, I think I put all of it up on the uh, on my PPG site for sale. I'm not going to keep any of this for myself. Something you want, get a hold of me. Let me know. We'll work out a deal. Talk to y'all later.